Last time on Mergen Vlogs, I hopped on a motorbike taxi at Fuente Osmeña to visit a brand new night market in Cebu City that has never been covered by a foreign YouTuber as it's only been around for the last two months. The market is so new that even the local taxi motorbike caballans weren't aware of its whereabouts and so in the previous video we spent the entire time getting lost exploring the bay area of Cebu City. However, with my determination and perseverance, and with a little bit of luck and help from a few more locals, we were finally able to locate the market in the end. And so in today's video, I'm going to tour you around this brand new night market, taste some of the food and desserts here, and run into a few people along the way. So definitely stay tuned until the end. Don't worry, I'll have a GPS pin uh, of this precise location in the Google, sorry, in the description so that you know where to come because uh, it took me quite a while to figure out where it was okay folks I've been walking around this market just to see what there is and uh, they pretty much have every sort of Filipino dessert, snack, food that you could ever possibly want from Lechon to my favorite Filipino dessert I can't remember the name it's really hard it's Puta Bombom Puta Bombom that's it that's it that's it I don't want to pronounce it wrong I love it it's so good it is really yummy. A Christmas dessert, right? Merry Christmas. <laughs> I think Christmas has come early for me. You know, the only place I had this was in Manila. So this is my first time I'm having it here in Cebu. Hope you'll have a great time too. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. How do you know me? <laughs> you know. That's why I visit Cebu. Oh, really? You visit Cebu because of my vlog? You're joking. Yeah. Oh my lord, look at this. Influencer, mate. <laughs> What's your name? Alan. Alan, nice to meet you, Alan. From Lisson. From where? Lisson? Yeah, I saw your vlog in uh, Temple of Playa. So, what, you been? Yes. Did you go already? Uh, tomorrow. Tomorrow? Oh wow, that's amazing. First day in Lisson. It's very beautiful. Uh -huh. Alright, I've just bumped into another YouTuber from Korea. Uh, he's lived in the Philippines for five years, incredible. He's on 300,000 subscribers, six times more than I am on. But yeah, we're both exploring uh, this night market here. What's your name? I don't know your name. Hello, my name is Inwook. Inwook, okay, what's your uh, YouTube channel? My, my YouTube channel is Inwook as well. My name oh, Inwook, okay. I'll have it in the description. Yeah. Yeah, we're doing a, this is my first collab with another YouTuber, but it's, it's uh, unintended. We've literally just bumped into each other and the market is like, oh, you YouTuber? Yeah, I'm a YouTuber. Oh, cool. <laughs> do you know a lot of food snacks here or no? Here? Yeah, do you know? Oh, really. So this is your first time here too? First time here, but I had food already. I've oh, you've had food I've already? Been, I came here like oh. three hours ago. Oh, three hours? No way. And they said at five. So uh, if it opens one hour earlier, then uh, you can actually come here during the daylight. Yeah, yeah. rather than when it's like really dark but uh, I'm seeing a lot of deep fried chicken, chicken burgers lots of lechon here, lots of lechon this is the third, this is the third store I've come across where they actually do lechon what else do we have on the left? oh this looks interesting it's like a rice dish and then there's like tables in the middle to eat your food right? right? yeah that's, that's pretty unique does everybody know each other? no? no you don't know each other? just eating in the middle Nice and convenient. Look at all the finished dishes. Okay, my friend has just gone off somewhere. I'm not sure where he's gone. He says he'll be back. And I asked him, are you sure you're going to be back? Because uh, I don't mind. Hello. Uh, he's like, yeah, I want to be back. I want to be back. Like, okay, cool. Um, but in the meantime, let's take a look at this lechon. Wow. Oh, salamat, salamat. Wow, so oily. Woo. Mm, a bit on the savory side. Oh, nice and tender as well. Is lechon usually hot or cold? Hot. Hot, okay. This is like room temperature. Market temperature. <laughs> Slightly higher than normal. Very nice and tender. How much is it, sir? How much? Okay, thank you. Ma'am, do you do chicken burgers or? Is that a chicken burger, yeah? No, pork. A pork burger, okay. It looks with dynamite fries. Yeah. Wow. It looks very appetizing. I think you have the most appetizing looking burger in the entire market. Thank you. <laughs> I don't know if I've already commented on this before, but uh, the level of activity here, hello. Uh, the amount of people here is crazy. But um, this market, all the stalls have red canvas roofs. It seems to be the theme of the market. Pizza, wow. Hi, sir. Hello, ma'am. Woo! 
Woo, woo, woo. Is that expensive? Yes. How much? 50,000. 50,000 pesos? Yes. Wow. Pizza for 200 pesos. Now ham and cheese. Ham and cheese. Ah. Do you do Hawaiian? Yes, we, we have Hawaiian. Nice. Oh, you're back. Yeah, I'm back. I thought you were gone. <laughs> gone forever. Oh, you found anything interesting or no? Uh, I made a friend there. Oh, the one at the end? Yeah. Oh my god, are you good at karaoke? Later. I'm terrible, I'm terrible. I've done it in more while, but uh, I can join you later if you want. Ah, Pancit, hello. Yeah. Pancit, yeah? Um, uh, bolognese. bolognese. Fourth stall that does lechon. Look how much lechon they have here. Wow, are you sure? It's actually uh, the pork adobo. And then the next is the lechon. Okay, so why why is this the best pork dish in the world? What's special about it? Uh, it's the spices and the. Oh uh, yeah. Yeah, and then uh, it's the process of cooking in this one. Okay. Yeah. How long does? A lot, a lot of work, a lot of time, yeah. Yeah, yeah right. Okay, can I try? Yeah, that's what they call. and uh, meat in it. Okay. That's in the belly part. Oh, the pork yeah, belly, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Lamikayo. Thank you. Very good. <laughs> it's so good. You should tell your friends to come over How much for serving? Yeah, this one, uh, good for two to three persons, it's only 175 pesos. 175 pesos, okay. To be honest, I think your lechon is probably the best one I've tasted. I can see by the skin of it, like it's been cooked perfectly. Yeah. Mm. Is all this meat from this? Yeah. From this, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's incredible. That's a full lechon. And you only have this much left, yeah? All right, thank you very much, sir. Beef paris. Sweet. Oh, this is a different beef paris. I tried beef paris in uh, Manila and um, it's very sweet. Okay, so in the middle of the market, uh, we've just crossed it. There's quite a few stalls and tables where you can eat your food. But this isn't the only place uh, where there's a seating area to eat your food. You can actually go down to the right and also down to the left. I would like to get a shake. What do you think? Yeah, because it's so hot, I think we should start the start the food experience, the food tour with a nice drink. Maybe from um, this sort of juice bar here. What is that purple stuff? Dragon fruit? Uh, big up, big up. Yeah, yeah, how do you do that? Ah. Shall we start eating? I can't eat. I'm you can't good. eat? Oh no, oh sir. Oh no. <laughs> In Wook has just ordered himself a uh, bubble drink. Is it bubbly? What's it taste like? It tastes like artificial blue yeah, yeah, yeah. lemonade. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah I, don't, I don't know why it tastes like lemonade. I think they actually put like a piece of lemon in there, giving it like that citrus. No, it's sparkling. No, it's not sparkling. It's, yeah, it's still. It's water and sugar, I believe, with a little bit of a uh, lemon feel. But you paid how much? 35 pesos? 60 pesos. I've only got my uh, bubble milk tea with brown sugar. Uh, it took quite a while, 15 minutes, but they did have a lot of customers and as you know, bubble tea does take a long time to make. Okay, I've got my drink. I'm now going to go to the food store in which I saw earlier and uh, get that much, much craved dessert. You don't know how long I've been craving that dessert for uh, since being here in Cebu. I could only find it in Tondo, Manila, but I, I found it here at Carver Market in Cebu City. So let's go grab it now. Uh, this, this store is always causing up a smoke. <laughs> Oh my god. In what is actually singing karaoke right now. I swear Koreans do be crazy sometimes. While he's sitting there singing karaoke, I'm gonna order up that uh bum 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 bum. Hello ma'am, can I get one puta puta bum bum? Yeah, that's it. Ah, no, no. Like 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 that, this one, like this one. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, in hindsight. Because this snack is so sweet. Oh, you don't use this one. No, I don't use one. Ah, it's not authentic. I'm joking. I'm joking. Usually, they they put the um the rice in here. It's rice, right? Yeah. yeah. Sticky, rice. Sticky rice in here, and then this will be like a furnace, and they will heat it up, and then they'll have to like slam it out, pour some coconut over it, condensed milk, and some cheese. Bam. But uh. They're using like a steam maker here. Never mind. I'm sure it's still gonna be good. Lamikayo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Lamikayo, man. 
Okay, so the central portion of the market where there's also tables. Hey, I saw you singing, mate. I was singing. <laughs> mate, you're having the time of your life. <laughs> you worked up a sweat, mate. Singing, uh, what's his name again? Justin Bieber. All right, so we've run away from the music uh, to come to this area here, which is like, I don't know, a three-step piece. And we're gonna have our food here and our bubble tea. It looks like custard now. I don't, I don't know what's wrong with it. Anyway, hopefully it's nice. Oh yeah, that's good. I like it. I'm usually very picky with my bubble tea, but um, they've got like some sort of buttery substance at the bottom. Which kind of tastes like cream brulee. What? <laughs> what? Yeah. What, is what is this? Well, mate, this is the best dessert you'll ever try in the Philippines, have in my ever, opinion. Have you ever tried it? Of course I have. That's why I'm recommending it. If I haven't tried it, I want to recommend it. Lami Kayo means uh, it's very delicious. It's like a... Uh, Majisok. Majisok. Yeah, yeah. Visaya or Tagalog? Uh, Visaya. Visaya. Uh, Tagalog, Tagalog is um, masarap. Masarap, yeah. Okay. Here it is, folks. Puta Bonbon. Unfortunately, it's all been like shoved to one side because I was swinging this bag pretty hard. But anyway. I'm going to let you do the honors and try out this wonderful Filipino dessert. Okay. Do you know what? What's do you want to know what it is? What's inside first? What is inside? Or do you want to try it out first? I'll try it out first. Yeah, yeah. Try it out first and uh, tell us your opinion on it. Without judging it. Or yeah, 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 yeah. It looks like a rice cake. So let's see. You're very right. It's made from rice. Good, right? Good. Your face was uh, like, mm, and then as soon as you put it in your mouth, it's good, right? Sweet. It's good. so sweet. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna go in. I'm gonna go in. It's trust me. Once you have two or three bites, you're gonna want to eat more. Is it warm as well? It's hot as well. It's ah, yeah, it's, oh, warm, it's warm. beautiful. If only I can divide this. There we are. There we are. First bite. Oh, it's so good. Nice and sweet. It's soft. Hi. There's stickiness to it. What are the ingredients inside? I know inside, rice inside it's pretty much rice. But then um, there's condensed milk, cheese, and uh, coconut. Coconut on top. Good. It's so good. But I'm so full. You can't be full. You got to keep eating. Yeah, I just have one more bite. Yeah, no, no, just eat as much as you can. <laughs> it's only like 65 pesos. This is 60 pesos. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Only. Hello. How are you? Is that your umbrella? No. Oh, okay. Mmm. <laughs> mm. Rami Kayo. Rami Kayo. Holy crap. I'm gonna have like a massive sugar rush. You finished? Yeah. No, man. I love it. I absolutely love it. I'm not the most graceful eater. <laughs> oh. There we are. Okay, here we go. Mm. Yeah, you know what it says? Yes, 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 yes. You like it? Um, I haven't really put it yet, but I, I, I guess it's nice. I guess it's, yeah, it's So good. No, 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 Korean. Onion oh, okay. <laughs> He's got a tan, right? That's why. We just met today, believe it or not. Yeah. And your vlog as well? Yeah, well, he's finished his vlog. I've only started mine. <laughs> On YouTube! Oh, okay, is that what you mean? <laughs> yeah, please subscribe. I will tell you once I'm done eating this wonderful dessert. I'll tell you right now. Don't worry. Okay. While, uh, while John Cook. <laughs> while John Cook sells uh, his girl on YouTube channels. I'm almost done. Finishing this dessert. Mm, 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 mm. Oh my god. Too good. Too good. 
I don't, I don't even know how old you are. Yeah, how old are you? I'm 24. I'm 28. I'm an old man. <laughs> I wish I was 24. I wish I was 24 vlogging with 300,000 subscribers. <laughs> He's got 300,000 subscribers. Uh, like, I took it seriously like two years ago. Yeah. No, I used to think it's two dialects. I used to think it's like a different dialect, different language. I feel full. I feel so full. It's probably because of all that sugar. I'm so happy right now. I need to sit down and just sleep. Yeah, it actually took me a while to find this place. I know, I do like food, markets, uh, what about beaches? beaches, snorkeling. So. Why are you wearing a jacket? Yeah, why are you wearing a jacket? Oh, yeah. But now it's very humid. Is this a new market? Two months ago. Yeah. So it looks like it is a brand new market, like yeah. two to three months old. How lucky are we? How are you going on Motorbike taxi. You have motorbike? I think I'll take my motorbike taxi, yeah. Which one do you use? Which app? No, I just talk to the local Kabayan. <laughs> do you do you say Kabayan in Visayan or no? Kabayan. Kabayan. You know what Kabayan is? Yeah, but like it's like a Tagalog word. Okay, so what's the Visayan? Oh, you don't know. <laughs> I didn't catch your names. What were your names? Uh, my name is Mai and this is Marjorie. Mai and Marjorie? Yeah. Nice to meet you. Yeah, we're like, um, we're from Cebu, but like. We're Have you lived abroad? What? Have you lived abroad? Abroad. Abroad. Um, not really overseas. Inter Island. <laughs> In what has been looking for a grab taxi for the past 15 minutes. Yeah, it's not. It's not coming, mate. Maybe I should get, get a, get a motorbike, motorbike taxi. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's negotiate a price for you. You wanna, you wanna help us negotiate a price for him? Come on, you're Visayan people. You need help out. You're a local tourist. Oh, it's quite far. What's far? It's far. <laughs> Bloody hell. This is like IT park, yeah? Yeah, IT park. Yeah, IT park. IT park is here. Yeah. Oh, shit. Um, if you want, we can just book you. Um, you Everybody's been trying to download this app called Angus. It's like a motorbike taxi app, yeah. uh, which you can download off the app store. But it's only available on the Filipino app store. It's not available on like the Korean app store or the... Yeah, um, yeah, it's a local app. That's why we can't use it. So uh, how useful is that to us? Zero use. He's pretty much living in the IT park. It takes it takes uh, me to get to the IT park from Fuente Osmania about 15 to 20 minutes. So from here, it's almost like double the distance. But Grab Taxi in, um, in Cebu is so much cheaper than Manila. But I, it feels cheaper because everything is closer. But I'm not sure if it if the cost per kilometer is actually cheaper or not. But because everything is so much closer, more concentrated, um, you can pretty much get a ride everywhere with Grab Taxi for 200 pesos. But if you go up into the mountains, it's like 400 pesos one way. <clears throat> what time do you go home usually? Who, me? I'll try and get home around about nine o'clock. We're just passing by a chapel here. I think it's pretty newly built. It's an open air chapel, it doesn't have any windows and it's got like this sort of nice kind of leaf pattern or wavy pattern. But uh, we're sending Inwook to uh, the Angus motorbike taxi that we've booked through Mia here so that he can go home, which is pretty far, almost, almost near the IT park. Once we're done with that, I'm going to head back to the food market and shoot Thank some you. more content. Thank you. Morgan, nice to meet you. Uh, let's Morgan. meet again, yeah? Morgan, Morgan right? yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, John Cook, man. Yeah. It's good to see you, man. John Cook, the next uh, You're the first YouTuber I've actually... Yeah, yeah. This is the guy, man? Yeah, this is the guy. Okay, because you're walking up. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, no worries. Take care, Mia. It's nice to meet you. Bye-bye. Thank you for booking an Angus for us. Morgan, thank you. Take care. Take care, man. All right. Uh, we've got Instagram, yeah?
Oh, hi, the Korean thing, yeah? Okay, yeah. take care, man. Anyan! Anyan! <laughs> He's got a long journey ahead of him. I don't even know how much uh, they're quoting him for it. Peace out, man. Take care. See you soon. Hopefully, the journey is all safe and sound. Um, I'm going to go back to the market, passing by this chapel yet again. But the chapel here is literally right next to the carbon market over there. And it's about a two minute walk, one or two minute walk. Man, how good were those vocals? I swear the Philippines have some amazing singers here. But uh, I'm not feeling that hungry. I don't know why. I, I won't. I was anticipating that I would try more things, but I've only had a puta bonbon, which uh, is very busy at this moment in time. It was really good. It's not made in the authentic way, but uh, nevertheless, it was still delicious. And I had too much. It's too much. I'm full now. And uh, I've also drink the coffee, which makes me even more full. Ah, uh, dang. Dang, dang, dang. Dang, ha? I don't know. Wait, wait, wait. How high is that? Okay, folks, as I've pretty much got no room left in my belly, I'm going to end up wrapping up today's video here but if you enjoyed today's video make sure you subscribe to the channel like today's video for me and share this video with friends and family so that they know about this brand new market here in Cebu City called Carbon Market but as always folks I'll see you in the next video on the channel many thanks for watching guys take care and bye for now bye bye